Hi and welcome to my random ruminations. Uh, this one's going to be a thrifting one. I slept an hour last night. I slept another hour a little while ago, so I'm my brain is fried right now. Uh, yeah. So uh, it's going to be a thrifting one, and I'm going to give out about a game. We'll get to that. Okay. So in the last two weeks, I've picked up a few nice things in thrift stores. One of them is my hero vest top. Well, actually, it's a long, long dress, but I kind of been folding it up, wearing it as a, as a a vest top and actually it's really comfortable it cost me two euros um, that is a still in packaging complete Gvart lamp from Ikea that cost I think two euros and uh, there is absolutely nothing wrong with it and it's going to be going up in here so I can light myself up a bit more clearly when I'm well lighting it's going to be going in there with a diffusing lens on it, a softening lens on it, to light myself up better when I'm doing my picture in picture let's place, because I can get good lighting from the right hand side, but not from the left. And related to this, or, right, yeah, and related to this, the light fitting in here is a normal drop down light fitting. I'm actually thinking I might get a single spot for that, and uh, actually a directable spot, and that way I'll be able to light the room up a little bit more, in a much more controlled manner. Uh, if I do that, you can expect a DIY video out of it. Um, yesterday, I picked up this. Now, ignore the fact that this is a Nikon bag. It's not a Nikon camera. Oh, no, no, no. For eight euros, I got this baby. It's Sony Handycam. It's DCR SX30E. Um, it's not HD. It records in 480 which you would consider would think that now wouldn't be of great use to me but actually i'm gradu i've been teaching myself to do things like putting like pictures up on the side and that kind of thing and this is ideal for recording that sort of b-roll so um because it's going to be a compressed picture anyway it's not going to be really noticeable and also it's a camera that if it gets damaged or destroyed i won't cry over it you know it's it cost me eight euros. Now, admittedly, it's missing the battery. Now, I did test it with a USB power supply, a tunable one, and it does work. Um, but a replacement battery is gonna cost me about 10 euros. I have a compatible charger. That's no big deal. Uh, charger, of course, goes in there. And uh, it's, like I said, it's a camera that I won't cry over if it gets dropped or destroyed or anything, because it costs next to nothing. Nice little feature with it is it has four gigabytes of memory built in. You'd think that wouldn't be a big deal, but actually, at the even at the highest quality recording on this, that will give me over 50 minutes of footage. You know, that means that it's a reasonably good standalone. And um, yeah, lens cover, of course. I'm quite happy with this. It's good little buy. I was really surprised by it, and uh, I'll be delighted when I get it working, but that will wait for a few weeks, I have other things to do first. Uh, speaking of things that I have to do, or in this case did, on Saturday we had a game night up at uh, Francois and Sabrina's, which are two of our best friends. Yeah. Kiwi and Sabrina decided to introduce us to a game called, I think, Rummy Cup? Rummy Cup? No, it's not Rummy Cup. Rummy Cub? I'm going to go with Rummy Cup because that sounds closer. Okay. It's this weird combination of Scrabble. Well, they said it was a weird combination of Scrabble and Gin. Now, I am screwed if I can see any relation whatsoever to Gin. What to me it seemed like was a combination of Scrabble, yes, because there's little tiles and they have numbers on them and yeah, and you lay them out. Spades, because you're trying to get rid of your hand. And some really bored New Zealander who was pissed out of his skull the day that he invented it. Because I watched a full game of it, and then I played a full game of it, and I still couldn't tell you how to play it. It is the most convoluted, confusing, head-fucking game I've ever played. And I've played Battlestar Galactica, the board game. Which, if you've played it, you know just how head-fucking and confusing that game is. I just... 
it was fun, but it was mostly fun because we were all so bloody confused. Well, at least I was. Yeah, it's not a game I'm going to be playing again. It it just, like... I was sitting there and Kiwi was reading out the rules. And it was just like, you do a what with a what? I, I don't, hang on, what's that? What does that have to do with... The, it just made no sense to me. None whatsoever. And I consider myself an educated intelligent woman of the world and you know something it totally and utterly defied me I just don't get it never want to play it again it just wrecked my head so yeah that was Saturday uh, I try to think did we play anything else that day no we mostly just played with puppies because there were four of them anyway yes um, I am running on very little sleep and uh, I think I'm going to edit this and I'm going to play Xbox for a while and just try and stay awake long enough that I get a decent night's sleep tonight because I'm freaking exhausted. Anyway, I will talk to you all again again. Oh, the, I will talk to you all again on Thursday and uh, tomorrow gunpoint and Friday. Of course, there's going to be an, actually again a really awesome episode of Dark Souls, like one where it just was wonderful it's probably going to be the last one of those because yeah I'm in bad places now very very bad places so yeah I'm going to say goodbye for now if you enjoyed this please like share subscribe and comment and I will talk to you all again soon bye